What is up guys, Ray here and in this video we are going to have our first look and unboxing of Nintendo's brand new console, the Switch. So I was fortunate enough to attend the midnight release of this console, super excited for it, cannot wait to play Zelda, but for now in this video we are going to unbox it, show you guys what's inside, so with no further ado let's get right into it. As you can see I went ahead and picked up the grey variant of this console, although a lot of people like the neon one, I like to stick with the classic grey. As soon as you take off the first lid, you will see a setup guide and how to plug it in. So on our right we have the Nintendo Switch console in tablet form, and on our left we have the two Joy-Cons. So taking the Switch out of the plastic, right off the bat, it looks like a Kindle Fire HD. I'm surprised how light it is, really light and it looks really well built. As you can see, we have the Nintendo logo imprinted on the back, a kickstand on the left, and I am not entirely sure if there are the speakers on the bottom. We have the cartridge slot, we have the up and down volume control buttons, and finally we have the power button. With that out of the way, let's continue. We have some more instruction manuals. And we have the left and right Joy-Con straps. It also comes with a Nintendo HDMI which is a bonus. We also have the power outlet and it's USB-C which is great news. Right here we have the Joy-Con grips. To me honestly it looks really cool that you just slide your Joy-Cons in and you get a traditional controller. Last but not least we have the Nintendo Switch dock. As the name implies, this is a dock where you store your Nintendo Switch console. In addition, it charges the Nintendo Switch tablet and the Joy-Cons. There's a nice back panel that you can take off and there's an HDMI out, there's a USB 3.0 and there's an AC adapter which is USB-C and I like it that you can close it back and hide all the cables. Right here we have the Nintendo Switch console and both Joy-Cons. So it's a pretty simple method to install the Joy-Cons to the Switch tablet. You gotta first align the Joy-Cons to the side of the tablet and just slide it down and once you hear that click you know that it's definitely installed. This is the kickstand, so I forgot to mention that right under the kickstand there is an entry for micro SD card so you can expand your storage. And it looks good, it stands straight once you put it on a table, it doesn't fall over like CNET's video so just disregard that video. So when you see that little button you just click it, pull up and once again your Joy-Cons are uninstalled. So right here I am installing the Joy-Cons on the Joy-Con grip, I really really like this. Once you install the Joy-Con on the grips, it looks like a traditional controller, super clean and I just love the overall look. To conclude this video, there are so many ways that you can play with your Nintendo Switch. I'm super excited that I got this console, I cannot wait to play even more Zelda. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about this console. Did you pick it up today? If so, let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.